so this is where I am. This is a little car camping spot. Hopefully it'll be better weather tomorrow. Oh God, I'm not even on the grass. I mean, I'm on the grass. Hi everyone. I've arrived. I'm absolutely soaking wet. My hair's standing on end. <laughs> it's peeing it down with rain. I opened the back, I laid my coat across the bed and everything so that if anything gets, well, I know the coat is going to get wet, but it's an outdoor coat so I can always put it in the front when it's when it's done. And I just wanted to make myself a cup of tea and uh, I've done that. It says, I don't know if you can see, it's got, it's got dogs on it and it says cuddles please. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to get any here. <laughs> And I don't mean that, I mean cuddles. I've given that up a long time ago. <laughs> anyway, I'm here. It's an absolutely beautiful site. There's a nice little honesty shop and everything. I've seen the chickens as I come in. They're massive and they're all golden coloured. So hopefully I'll be able to enjoy it. You know, like tomorrow maybe when, when I get up. It might not be raining, but we'll see. I'm hoping I've turned the alarm off. Who knows? Um, I've got a magazine to read and I've got my cup of tea and that's all I need and you can I've put the I've put the top back down the top the um, tailgate and uh, that's that's where I'm sleeping tonight <laughs> if I can get in otherwise it'll be I won't be moving from this seat but uh, no it's starting to there's a bit of condensation I can't I can't crack the window and put the the blackout things on because it's just too wet so um, yeah I think there's going to be a, quite a bit of condensation no getting away from it I think I have brought one of them con condensation things Hot, with yeah. all the granules in the bottom but I think that'll be that'll be full in an hour if this carries on <laughs> I know that because I've been outside making a cup of tea I've put all the bits and pieces under the car um, so, well, you can't put anything hot back in here, can you? So I've, I've just shoved it under the car. It's not going to get wet. It's, it'll be right. It'll be right. But I am a little bit damp. That's another reason why I didn't get straight in the back, because I don't want to make the bed um, damp as well. I can see, I can't, I can't put the windows down because the car's not on. I can see the geese. If I turn you round, there's a van just pulled up, but just to the right side of the van, there's some geese. Um, yeah, everything just walks around willy nilly <laughs> by the look of it. So no, I'm not. I'm I'm not serious. There is little fences everywhere for other things. I think because I know they've got goats and they've got bees in the garden. So we'll see what else there is. But uh, yeah, I've arrived safe and sound. My God, the the bee roads. They're definitely bee roads. They are so narrow. Um, and of course, who had to go and meet a truck coming the other way? Oh yes, just yours truly, of course. But uh, yeah, no. Way. So right, I'm gonna read my. I haven't brought a book. I've actually brought a magazine. I've got two actually. And um, yeah, I'm gonna carry on with my story that I started earlier on. All right then. All toasty. Look at me hair. I'm going to get rid of that. I got something from Timo, like one of those heated brushes. Let's see if it works. We're going to put things to the test on this little breakaway. Yeah, so I'm in Devon. See you soon. Bye for now. Well, I'm snug as a bug in a rug. <laughs> oh, crikey. I tell you what. It's not as easy as I thought it was going to be, but it's still doable, if you know what I mean. Um, I've just had a nice, nice warm drink and I've got into bed. I think it's probably about half past eight, nine o'clock, something like that. Um, I've got my duvet off my bed because I didn't want to spend too much money on things. Even though I have bought a few too many bits, but I did get them off Timo, so that's not too bad. I, It stopped raining, yay! I've had a look at the Robbie Rome's book. And uh, I'm thinking I might go to Ilfacum tomorrow um, for a day out and do a bit of exploring. 
Um, I've just found out one of my old bosses lives round here. I mean, how bizarre is that? <laughs> and she's lovely. The only thing is, she this weekend she's going up to where I come from. Where I've just come from, so which is obviously where we know each other from. Um, but yeah, can you believe it? Otherwise, I would have been going down for Sunday dinner. I was invited. I weren't inviting myself. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so I've uh, got my light on, my Timu light. It's quite bright, actually. And uh, I'm, a yeah, I'm nice and snug and warm. Um, mind you, would, you would be with a king-sized um, furry duvet cover. <laughs> Yeah, and it's feather as well, so there's no problems there. Condensation doesn't seem to be too bad at the moment. I just wonder what I'm going to wake up like. If it's anything like camping when we used to go with mum and dad, everything used to feel damp. I hope to God that doesn't happen, because that will definitely put me off. Uh, yeah, a bit of um, jiggery poker, you know, moving things around tomorrow, and uh, I think that'll be better. Just uh, know where everything is. Um, but yeah, we're on our way. So, check in with you again soon. Oh, and I'll take you for a walk around tomorrow, show you what this place is like. It's lovely. Okay, bye for now. Good night. <laughs>